Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be explaining how to create a simple Google App Engine application using Java. All you need is an Eclipse version of 3.6 or higher with Google App Engine plugin installed. Uh, once you're done with that, uh, click on this Google icon here and click on New Web Application Project. Give a project name. GAE App. Package name. uncheck the google web toolkit option as we'll be using the default sdk this one then click on finish uh, when you finish you'll get a project structure like this with src folder app engine sdk jerry system library and var in var uh, you'll be having the index.html page uh, by default uh, there will be a uh, there will be this uh, this code in that and in the src folder you'll find the uh, java servlet file uh, where you can write the logic of the web application which we'll be creating okay so after doing this uh, let's run the application locally in order to do that uh, go to run as web application So once the application uh, is compiled and run, uh, you'll get an URL like this one. Now the application is running on localhost 888. Let's check. Paste the URL in the browser. As you can see, uh, the Hello App Engine, which is this page, is being displayed. So when I click on this, the servlet that is the GA app servlet gets executed. We are able to see the hello world being printed there. So this is how a simple Google App Engine application works. Uh, in the in this Java file, you can write any l Java logic you want and create a front end for th for that in this WAF folder. So after doing this, the next step is. Uh, to deploy this application in order to do that first go to appengine.google.com and create a new application give a unique uh, application identifier yes once you give the identifier uh, give a title and create application so now the application is registered in the google app engine uh, in your account but still it has any uh, no application hasn't been deployed so in order to deploy go to your application uh, open the web inf folder in that go to app engine web dot xml in this file give the application ID which you had created that is this ID SDM GAE paste it here once you are done with this now the application is ready to be deployed so let's deploy this in order to deploy go to Google and deploy to App Engine yes let's save the changes click on deploy the deployment has been completed successfully and here is the URL for your app one dot uh, signifies that this is the first version of your application Now the app has been deployed. Uh, you're getting hello world as we got it when we had run it in the local server. And here in the dashboard, you can see that SDMGAE is running. This is how you can create a simple application and deploy it. So now, similarly, 
I have created a simple application and I have deployed it. Yes, this which is this one. Uh, this application simulates the scheduling algorithms. All you have to do is choose an algorithm, enter the number of processes, give the burst time of the process, and it computes the average turnaround time and the average waiting time. So let's see how this application works. So uh, when the application is first being run, that is this is the page that is being displayed. Okay, choose algorithm. When you choose, when I chose FCFS and uh, entered the number of processes, the control got switched to FCFS.jsp, which is this page. So here. Uh, we entered the burst time for the processes which we had selected and the uh, computation was done and the result was displayed okay and when choose SJF similarly another algorithm SJF when SJF is selected enter the burst time Yeah, the second process burst time is lower. That's why it got executed first. So let's see the working of this. Similarly, in the home page, when I chose SJF, the control got switched here to SJF.jsp. In SJF.jsp, the number of processes which are stored in the session in the previous page was retrieved and those many text boxes got generated. Once the text boxes got generated, the user entered the input and the result was computed using this logic. So this is how simple Google App Engine application works. Thank you.